Hello. Welcome. Welcome to tonight's live sizing and styling guide. Hey. Our holiday edition. Holiday, Hello. Holiday, holiday. I don't know where you guys have been. I've been live for eight minutes just waiting for you. <laughs> just kidding. Just hanging out over Just here. hanging here. Just, just standing waiting. here waiting for y'all to get on. Just waiting. That's just like us to be right on time. <laughs> we were just waiting for you guys this time. I don't know why y'all were late, but. Not everybody else. Story of our life. <sighs> Hello, everybody. Welcome. Welcome to this fun little live. <laughs> it is the start of holiday. Who's feeling festive? I am. Um, I mean, I'm trying to get there. You know, when I posted asking if y'all were ready for this, I think I should have like asked myself, am I ready for this? <laughs> <laughs> I think I should have reflected and said, am I, am I ready to do this? Are we I turned ready? on Christmas music a couple hours ago, trying to get there. Yes. <laughs> we were, Black Friday, yeah. Holly and I were cracking up. I walked into a room and I was like, when did the Christmas music turn on? <laughs> I wasn't ready. I wasn't expecting that. Christine said she was thought I was trying to find my festive. Yes. Which was true. Side. Which was true. I was trying to pull it out of me. So here we are. And you know, I mean, this is actually late for Christmas. Every year we're like, we're going to launch Christmas earlier. So much earlier. That's always the plan. <laughs> so uh, maybe. Karina, I think the push notification might have been a minute after we started. There might have been a slight delay. It's on the same time schedule as we are. <laughs> same time yes. schedule. I'm just getting this earlier. shared all around you guys. If you guys, if you guys share for us, now is a great time to do that. As well as we have so many fun new goodies to share with you. This is a jam-packed live. So, like, 30 seconds in outfit again tonight. That's what we're doing. Yeah. I say again like I've ever accomplished that before. Right. Yeah. 30 seconds. 30 seconds in outfit as soon as I get these shared. Megan, I just want to know where you hit all of those uh, shoes you got. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, is it candy? Is it Black Friday yet? Listen, we're going to need these next 14 days to recover to get ready for Black Friday. <laughs> yeah, we'll get there, but whoa. <laughs> yeah, we're getting there, but it's slow. <laughs> it's slow. And I was just kidding. I do start planning it before the Monday before. Could you imagine? We wouldn't <laughs> have anything to sell if I wait. <laughs> I know. You should see. See. We're going to do away with Black Friday and we're just doing deal or no deal again. Just kidding. Christine's Thank you, face. Yes, lost my DND mega box. Oh, Beth, there's no way that happened. It just hit the mail yesterday. <laughs> they didn't lose they it. They better not have lost it. They didn't lose it. All right, I think it's I'm all sure. All a coming. It's a coming. All right, you guys. Well, hello. Merry Christmas. Feliz Navidad. Da -da 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 Hello. All right, you guys. Well, this is the start of our holiday launch today, and we have a lot of items to get through. We will have more holiday showing up over the next couple of weeks, um, but this is a good bulk of what we currently have here. Like I said, there's more, more coming, but this is all fantastic. This sweater, ah, one of my favorites. So we are excited to launch this to you. Um, we have obviously been scrambling the last few days to get order shipped uh, and worked a lot of very long days. Today has also become a very <laughs> long day. Um, but there are a couple of things that I had to tweak and finish up on the website to get like our holiday collection in one place. So tonight you will be able to find featured new this week, which is where you'll find all these new days. And then there will also be a featured and it's the holiday collection where you'll be able to find all the things. So we have some things that have restocked from last year. We have some things that will keep continually being added to that holiday collection as we add more items. So you'll be able to end up finding it all in one place throughout the next several weeks. Um, and I will tonight, tomorrow, tweak like I said, finish tweaking that little collection and getting it prettied up on the site and maybe get the site looking a little bit more 
Christmassy. Uh, I think it started snowing in the app today because it started snowing here in Michigan. So if you use the app and it's snowing there, um, that would be why I felt like it was appropriate for it to begin snowing. Um, so yeah, you did comment on it. That what? It was, it, there was a comment that they loved it snowing in the Does app. Does it snow when you're watching this? Does it snow on top of it? Hold on. I don't have the app open. Let me look. Yeah, me look. I have it over. Is it look. snowing right now, Candy? Yeah, I've got the snowflakes on. Is it, well, but when you me, click into the video, into is video. it snowing or is that annoying? No, it's not snowing while you're live. Okay. It just snows in just the app. In the app. Okay. So yeah, some fun little things, but you guys, we have a lot, like I said, that is still coming Christmas. I was a little behind on ordering our Christmas earrings this year. So we do have a selection of them that you will see tonight, but we have lots more coming and by golly, are they all so cute. There are so many that even as I was like ordering them, I'm like, oh, this will be so cute with that sweater and this sweater and this and this and this. So there'll be some awesome earrings coming too. Yeah. As well as of course, other Christmas goodies um, and fun stuff and Black Friday, just a couple weeks away. Um, but yeah, so this is the launch and I'm so excited for it and we better get started because we have tons. So if you're new here, welcome. This is a live sizing and styling guide. We're going to go over the Fitz fabrics and all the details of these new goodies releasing tonight. They will be available for purchase immediately following the live on the app and on the website. So no need to claim throughout the live. Just sit back, relax, make a little list of your favorite things that you know you're going to want to snatch up afterwards. And then you'll be able to shop these on the app or the website after the live. Um, if you have questions throughout, please post those in the comments. Christine will respond to you there. If you'd like to see Christine try something on, feel free to just say, and she will gladly put it on for you and come on out here so you can see her in it. Um, I'm Rachel. For reference, I'm a size eight. I tend to always wear a small on top, seven in Judy Blues on bottom or a medium on bottom um, if they are a letter sized bottom. Um, and yeah, I think that's it. One other thing for you, dealer and do people, anybody who bought more than one thing in your orders merged, it sounds like you all got a little bonus of double style stash points. So don't think we didn't know that happened. It wasn't <laughs> on purpose, but I know what happened. So enjoy yeah. using those Will you shop this holiday collection, you little stinkers. Next year, I'm going to have to tweak that. <laughs> <laughs> So not only did you get some killer deals, you got double style stash too. You didn't notice. You're welcome. <laughs> Just kidding. I mean, I'm not, but I am. That's one of those, like, what do we say? Like, no offense. But then when you say it. No offense. Yeah. So whenever somebody, like, typically when I say just kidding, like, I mean it. But then I'm like, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. Okay. You can put my comment up there. I You kept rambling. So I didn't think I was supposed to. All right. Well, let's go ahead and get started because we got lots to get through, guys. Um, first up, this absolutely adorable sequined sweater. This is called the Christmas Rudolph Sequin Sweater in Ivory. It's available in sizes small through 3X. I am shown in the small and it is a slightly relaxed fit a little bit more fitted on the hips not snug by any means has stretch and comfy like comfort to it um this is like a medium to light like medium weight i'd say medium to lightweight so it's not super heavy if you live somewhere warmer this would be um a great sweater for your climate where it's not going to be too hot um and the sequins are real sequins and they are adorable um the little reindeer on here little rudolph his sweater is hot pink, just so there's no confusion about whether it's hot pink or red. I do have it paired with these scarlet um, pants, which I love because I think with the sequins and the different dimension of color that you get, it's okay that they're paired together. Um, but it is like a fuchsia hot pink and that bright Kelly green. So cute. I just love this little reindeer. Um, I would say stay true to size in the sweater for that little bit of a relaxed fit that you get in the mid but otherwise it's a really great fit. Uh, fabric content on this, 100% acrylic. It is not itchy, scratchy, anything. Just really cute, comfy, easy, and that reindeer is adorable. And it also comes in black. I'm gonna show you guys that and not put this one on um, just because I don't think that it's necessary. Same fit, same details, but in black. So same where it's that fuchsia viva magenta uh, sequin detail, but he is so cute. I just love him. Like I said, same everything on it, but you can choose if you are an ivory or a black um, in this one. Whatever your preference is, is what you can go with, but I adore it. Um, and then I have a new pair of Judy Blue jeans on. So these are the Judy Blue 
Tommy Control, skinny jeans, and Scarlet. Christine's nodding her head. Yeah, you didn't need surprise that, that I all. got that. Um, these fit exactly like the cobalt and the red. If you guys remember when those came out, if you snatch them up, they fit exactly the same. So I am shown in my normal 728 in these, and they're pretty fitted. In the cobalt and the red, both of those, I said I would size up one, and in these, I would as well. I do have a little bit of stretch here, but they're they're pretty, pretty, pretty skin tight, I would say. Like, I can grab them a little bit, but they're they're pretty fitted. So most people did opt to size up one in that cobalt and in the red. I would suggest doing the same in the scarlet. Uh, if you have the scarlet jogger, these are the same color, same material as those, um, which they're just a really pretty, like crimson red, great for this time of year, are going to go with everything holiday-ish. So they're fantastic. Just I would recommend sizing up one from your normal Judy Blue size, or if you got those cobalt or red that came out in the summertime, stick with your same size in those that you did, but they are so stinking cute. Like I said, I am in my normal 728, but I don't have as much room as I typically like uh, in my waist in Judy Blue. So, love these. And then what shoes do I have on here? These are the Artin. These have been a fan favorite, like sold out, reordered, sold out, reordered. Um, and they are just fabulous. We have a restock here that we had just said right after the live, we can run and check in so we can get them back on the site. If you guys miss them, know that it will take us about 15 minutes after the live and we can get them loaded. Um, so that way you guys can shop these as well. But these are, honestly, these have kind of like for us gone viral where they are selling out. We cannot keep them in stock. And if you snatched up the sand or the black, to be honest, um, either one, they are superb. I'm pretty sure we ordered the very last of the black that they have. And a couple of weeks ago, we ordered the very last of the sand that they had. So there is no more sand to be had or be ordered. Uh, we got the rest of those and they are almost sold out on our site. Uh, but the black, we have one last restock of these that we are going to post after the live. They run quite true to size, in my opinion, if you wear a sock. Um, if you have a narrow foot, I think that I've seen a few people say that they've sized down half size. I would not necessarily recommend that unless you have a narrow foot and you often size down because of that. Otherwise, stay true to size. But they are just the best. So cute and super trendy. So this is the art in. Like I said, we have a restock that we will be posting as soon as the live is over. There are still, I think, most sizes available on the site with the exception of a few um, that will get reposted with the, with the restock. Look, I the can't five. think of words. Words yeah. are hard. They're six and a half, seven, eight and a half are out right now, but they'll be back up. Yes, about 15 about minutes. Hours. Yes. <laughs> about two hours, 15 minutes after the live is done. So, okay, I'm going to go ahead and, oops, turn my light off. Put this down for just a second, a little, oh gosh. Oh boy. Oh, don't boy. touch things. Don't, don't touch things, What's Rachel. What's happening? Oh boy. All right. On to outfit number two. All right. All right. Kind of like outfit three, kind of. 46 outfits to go. Yes. <laughs> it looks like it. Looking it does. Like it's a big old lineup. But it's holiday. It's and we love holiday. holiday. We love it. We sure do. I'm getting there. Oh, I should probably put on some different earrings. Like I said, we have a ton, ton, ton of cute holiday earrings that are coming. We'll get those loaded as soon as they're here. And then we'll show them next week, too, so you guys can see them. Um, but I love this little monochromatic outfit. I didn't put, I took my boots off, um, but I love those boots paired with this. What? I mean, they would have been perfect. You they didn't have to take off. No, I didn't. Um, I just took one off to show it and then continued. So this is the figured out top in wine and black in Fair Isle. So a lot of you have gotten the figured out top. We've shown these again and again and again and again. It's probably becoming very redundant. You all could probably give the spiel for me. Um, but this top, slightly relaxed fit, roomy, stretchy material, 94% polyester, 6% spandex. Most people do opt to size down one in these. I am shown in my true size small. Um, but this is a really fun one for the holiday season. I love it because it can be, for these Fair Isle prints can be carried into kind of January and February as well, where they're more winter prints than Christmas specific. Um, but it is really cute for Christmas. Gives you kind of that sweater look to the print. Um, and this is very consistent with the other 
So I figured out tops that we've had. So whatever size you've done in those, we suggest doing the same in, in this one. Uh, but it is a perfect color match. I know some of you love those perfect color match combos. This would be one again. And this one mat would match the joggers identically as well. If you have those already and would want to make this into an outfit with that, you could because that would be a perfect color match too. So the figure it out top, just around these little fringes, Christine grabbed me all the red and green earrings she could find. <laughs> <laughs> Since I don't have a ton of Christmas ones today, it makes me sad. I wish I, I think I was like 10 days ago and I was like, oh my gosh, I think it was when I was having my Christmas meltdown that like she realizing a Christmas meltdown. that when I was realizing that Christmas was coming and I wasn't ready, I was like, oh my gosh, I haven't ordered earrings yet. Thankfully, uh, Amber is so fast at making them. So they'll be here soon. They are in the mail. We were having a Christmas meltdown 68 days before Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Jake texted us earlier and said that there was something wrong with their kids. They were requesting Christmas music at dinner. And I was like, well, if their mom has it, I'm here. So <laughs> there's that. He said that over the weekend while we were here do doing deal or no deal, if they had Christmas music playing while they were doing homework. <laughs> and then somebody suggested watching a Hallmark Christmas movie. And I said, I already had yesterday. So oh, apparently you're in whole... the spirit. Oh yeah, I am. I'm, yep. In a it. minute. I'm in it. I'm pretty sure it's one that you already watched. If you guys don't know this, Netflix, stop listening right now. Um, I steal my sister's account so I can see. <laughs> don't announce that. <laughs> Who is watching what? And every so often I'll go to watch a Hallmark Christmas movie and like, oh, I must have already watched it. But I started anyway and then I do the like, oh, Rachel must have watched it because <laughs> I don't know this. <laughs> what was it about? Which one was it? Um, it was... Holidays in Handcuffs with Melissa Joan Hart and Mario Lopez. Oh, yes. I've watched that. Yeah. You had. I have not. <laughs> yes, Jillian, we have Christmas music on for the live. We started it. Holly was still here, and I walked into a room, and I was like, who did this? Who has done this? <laughs> <laughs> I turned it on a couple hours. But I love Christmas music. Like, now that it's on... I'll listen to it for the next two months. Well, we will not hear. And that's Rachel and Walt. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to have to figure out how to have the boutique play its own station <laughs> again. Right now we have them the same. So we, I think we have like seven Alexas here throughout the boutique and the warehouse and our shipping room and every room. And they all play the same thing. But we might have to figure out how to make the boutique play something different. Because I can't do Christmas music. For I feel like if you just tell it. Like just that one, because now you have to do the whole everywhere thing. You know, if you do everywhere and then you just oh, tell yeah. her something different for her in the boutique her. Okay, we'll see. All right. Well, here is a fun little, not so festive, but a fun outfit for Christmas parties. If you don't do lots of red and green and glitzy, this is a really cute outfit for a Christmas event um, that it's just stunning. I absolutely adore this top. We've actually had this here um, two I, months I maybe. I've know. been I'm, waiting because I yeah. knew when it came on in, it was going to be part of the Christmas collection, the holiday collection. And it is so stinking pretty. So this is called the Call You My Own Sweater Top. It's available in sizes small through 3X. Um, I am shown in the small and it's a little bit more fitted here up top. Sweater is really stretchy. So it gives you that fitted look, but it's still very comfortable and stretchy and then has just this cute little peplum waist on it. So um, it hits actually like right at my belly button. So it's not exceptionally long. Um, that is, I would opt to wear a higher pant like I have on than wearing something low where I would risk showing my belly. You can kind of see like right where it hugs to is then about where this little peplum starts. So there's really no chance of me showing off much of my skin or anything like that. So I think it's a really cute piece. Um, and it's just darling. I am showing my true size small, a little bit of a mock neck on this one. And then these super soft kind of satiny 
not satin. These aren't satiny. What is, what is this called? Has chiffon. more chiffon sleeve to it. So it has a little bit of structure that gives you that fun little billow. And then you have that sweater cuff down here as well. So nice and stretchy down there too. So true to size, um, you can size up one if you want a little bit more room in this section, but like shoulder wise, everything fits in a good place. Nothing is pulling too tight, anything like that. It's really a great fit and super cute to top. So Loving this piece. It would really be cute too if you wanted to throw in a pair of colored denim with it. That would be a cute option to add in some color. Um, because we were doing this like black on black look, I just threw on these fun little Christmas leopard tree earrings, which are available on our site right now. We already have these in stock and they are just adorable too. Again, if you don't do lots of reds and greens and glitzy, this is a cute option to be festive and still show your favorite neutral print here, this animal print. Um... What's happening? FB seems to be a little, Facebook seems to be a little laggy and a oh. little behind. The app is working beautifully, ladies. So I don't think that it's necessarily our internet. It must be a connection to Facebook some way because the app looks beautiful. Uh, so if you're having issues with a grainy picture, hop on over to the app. I'm answering questions and comments there too. You won't miss anything. Um, yeah, just make sure on the app to like comment. Otherwise it looks like there's nothing going on and that's always such a bummer. Yeah. So <laughs> some people are saying their video is fine. Yeah. It might be, might have to do weather wise two places. I can see here, it's still like rainy and icky out. It's been like raining, sleeting all day long on and off. So, okay. You guys new pants too. These are superb. Did you look up what the name of that other pair was? The other pants that I compared these to? Oh, no, but I think you're, I will right now. But okay. I'm pretty sure you were right that it's the here's to us. Okay. So this summer we got a fantastic um, pair of pants in, in actually like a khaki and a black. If you guys snagged them, you're going to know, snag them, snatch them up. You are going to know what I'm talking about. They have the same little pockets here, same type of waist, and they were a little bit of a craft length. They are called the here's to us pants and they are just superb. Well, these pants are the same, same brand. Um, but they are a, faux vegan or vegan leather, not faux vegan. That would be like opposites. Um, these are called, these are called the sassy vegan leather pants. They're available in sizes small through three X. Um, and they are super, I am shown in my true size medium. Medium is what size I do in pants. This is what size I did in the here's to us pants. And I would say these fit identically. I had just a little bit of room in my waist, but this material has like what feels more like give than stretch. Um, and, but they're just like a perfect fit. So I'd say if you got the here's to us pants, we had a ton of you get those. Um, and I would say if you've gotten those, these are going to fit exactly exactly the same to them. They are just so good and a fantastic pant. So they do have little pockets on the bum and then these cute little front pockets on them. And these are just great. So they're considered like a wide leg, just that like straight cut wider leg on them. Um, but they have a really nice like trouser fit up top where they're, they have a great fit here. And I don't know, they're just fantastic. These are really fun and a great option for holiday season when you want to have something a little dressier, but you maybe don't do dresses or skirts. Um, maybe you don't do leggings and it really limits some of your abilities to be able to style things because you want to still be dressed up, but you don't want to just be in your everyday black pants. These are superb. So true to size, uh, they, do these come in XL and 1X? Christine no, has left the room. One X, two, okay. Mine out real quick. <laughs> these, I, didn't you do 1X in these? I don't think so. I think you did. Well, then I guess my doctor was right. I'm fat. <laughs> Christine is putting them on right now, Gretchen. So we can see she was thinking that she had to switch pants, but I thought she did the one X. No, the two X. So. Okay. Um, so whatever size though you did in the here's to us pants, I would say stick with the same. And that could very well be that you did the two I, because there wasn't a yeah, XL and one X. Yeah, usually there's an extra large and a one X that I can stay in the one yeah. X, but when there's only a one X to a two X, then I need to go up that one. Yes. And then I felt that a glitzy boot with this was needed. What are these called? These are the Katie in Pearl, Katie Pearl in black. Um, and these are just a really pretty, again, keeping that whole kind of black kind of theme going on here. These do have some like gunmetal, uh, little pretty beads. Jordan, I'll measure the inseam. 
I don't know that it's listed. I, yeah, I'll measure it when sure Christine either. comes out here. Um, but these are a really pretty one that has like little black pearls mixed in with the little gunmetal studs. A really great neutral option, but we have tons of fun boots. I'd like even like one of the white ones would have been so pretty or the maize in the rose gold. Like you could do any color in a fun boot too to add a little pop of something else. But I just kept it neutral with the blacks. But very true to size on all of these pretty glitzy boots that we have on the site. They are perfect for the holiday season. Again, dresses something up without being um, like totally out of a comfort zone. I love these. They're cute with like the faux leather leggings as well, or even a basic mm -hmm. legging, a blazer and a, you know, some sort of cami. So they're fantastic. And I think you can pair some really cute outfits that don't make it holiday specific that you'll be able to get wear out of pieces again. I think sometimes that's what Christine and I even talked about running into is like we have this holiday specific and this holiday specific and this, you know, such specific pieces that then we come to like a regular just middle week of the month of December and we're like, well, what do I have to wear? Because everything I have is like so specific for certain events. So these pieces are fun because you can wear them with a lot of different things. So Christine's going to come on out here and I'm going to measure the inseam on these. I am. I'm coming from the wrong direction. I feel like I'm going to trip over something. Hi, thanks for being here tonight. How is everybody on Facebook and the app? If you are new here, I am Christine. I am a size 14, 16, but according to my doctor last week, I'm closer to a 16 and the pants say that's true. <laughs> so let me step back so you can get a full look. Um, so again, 14, 16, I tried to put the one X on and the button was about that far apart to me. 28 and a half inch inseam on these. Well, oh, it's a really good length. It is. It's a nice length. They had, I'm 5'8 for reference. Rachel is 5'7 and they're on the floor. So it's got a little bit, you know, it's not like jeans where the inseam is all the way up. There's a little bit of a drop in the rise. If that makes sense. I'm trying to say it without saying icky words. Icky words. <laughs> There's, where, what did I, never mind. I'm just going to move on. I'm just going to move on. So the 28 and a half inch inseam starts about two inches lower than it normally would. But again, I'm in the size 2X. I have a little bit of room. Um, so it's not like choking me, giving me muffin top. It's smooth right there, but the 1X I couldn't get buttoned. Um, so again, when there's an extra large and a 1X, I stay in the 1X pant. When there is a 1X and a 2X with no extra large, that's when I move up to the 2X because it seems like there's a couple inches that are missed right there. And then for this gorgeous top, I am in the 1X in this as well. Well, not as well because the pants are a 2. But <laughs> <laughs> I absolutely love the fit of this. The little puff sleeve, the shirt I wore today had puff sleeves. I'm all about the puff sleeves and the ruffles and the everything. But such a cool that's outfit that like... Christmas parties, New Year's Eve parties, all kinds of stuff. And we even have, this reminds me of the one that I wore to the Herman Hiss night that is sheer puff sleeve like this, but with shimmer down the front. We still have that in the full size run that I can tag in our holiday oh, collection the black too. One? Yeah, the black that has, it's almost the same structure. It doesn't have the peplum, but would be awesome with these pants too and add just a little bit of shimmer and shine, but true to size in that one as well. So. That's it. Before I confuse you further, I'm going to leave. About being the exact same size and I'm not. We were also trying to get festive with our drinks tonight. Yes. So we have the red, white, and Mary. I don't feel like this tastes like it did last year. Maybe it is from last year. <laughs> uh, let me drop some comments. Let me drop some comments. Okay, throw on these cute little Santas, little Santa hats, and the animal print, which are a really cute match with this. The little trees were a cute match as well, but these little little Santa hats are so fun with the little like actual puff ball on there. Um, okay, next up I'm in the watch over you leopard blouse. This is another one everyday piece that you can like pull into holiday, which is cute. So I still have on those faux leather pants took my shoes off. Um, but this would be a cute option as well. A little bit more relaxed wearing it with a graphic tee. Um, but you could again, dress it up, wear a pretty like 
red burgundy wine color camisole underneath this and you know add that pop of like holiday color uh, with it still being more neutral and then your fun little Santa ear Santa earrings or holiday earrings make it a holiday piece um, but I loved liked it with this graphic tee for just a little bit of a different look uh, this little top is like a oh my gosh am I having a problem with words chiffon sheer sheer semi sheer so it's really lightweight no sheen to it so if you don't do shiny you know um satin finish this does not have a satin finish to it but it's a really cute fit little puff sleeve on this one um as well and i'm in my true size small and i do have some extra room i would say if you're in between sizes you could go down in this one as it does have a relaxed fit especially if you aren't somebody who's gonna button it tuck it in and wear it like dressy style, then you could absolutely size down to wear it open because there's lots of room here throughout. But I absolutely adore this top um, just for any time of the year, but it's really cute for holiday too. Like I said, pulling in some of these holiday pieces. So I have it layered over this fantastic graphic tee uh, that says, Oh, Holy Night and it has gold glitter. It's gold glitter on here and then has the little stable on there. Um, which is just fantastic. So loving this one to kick off our graphic tees for the holiday season. So Oh Holy Night. Now this is a Bella Canvas tee and it, it runs true to size. So I have that normal kind of relaxed fit with Bella. Um, you can size up one if you like an oversized fit or want a roomier fit, but most people opt to stay true to size in these. They are considered unisex fit. Uh, so in this one, I would say stay true to size. And this is a really dark, it's like more of a Heather Black than a Heather Charcoal, I would say. Um, or it just, it's really quite, quite dark, 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 um, over charcoal. Don't you think? Yeah, I do. Yeah. It's heathered black. So cute, a little combo there. And now I'm going to change. You go do that. I'm gonna I'll go ahead and change. You're supposed to have a pair of jeans. They're right somewhere. here. Oh, okay. I was going to say <laughs> there was a point where you were supposed to have a where I wasn't going to be wearing these all night. They're yeah. very comfortable. Honestly, these whole leather pants are so comfy. They, yeah. And they're For nice being and soft. Leather you should show ish. me inside. Like, because they're almost them like inside. a. <laughs> <laughs> I caught them, though. They're like a suede velvety kind of finish on the inside. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what you can see. <laughs> I don't know how to show it. But it's not like. You know what? Most times you expect that faux leather, vegan apparently is the fancy way to say it now, um, that it's going to be the same material inside and out. And so like it's going to stick to your legs and you're going to be sweating and you're going to have to roll them on and peel <laughs> them off. Like the thought of going to the bathroom and like, oh, they're probably stuck somewhere. <laughs> These are super soft and it's, I mean, it's made like, you know, I don't offend anybody here. If you're part of PETA, we love animals. We also love to eat them. <laughs> <laughs> But we don't wear them. We wear vegan leather. <laughs> oh God, you guys, we've got like eight hours of sleep in four days. Forgive me. Um, but it's made like a real hide. Leather on one side, suede on the other. Isn't that how that works? Is that how that works? Is that how that works? I imagine that that's how that works, right? You don't get like leather or suede, right? Right. Or do you? <laughs> is one side leather and one side is suede? <laughs> or is it like material that the more you brush it, the softer it the gets? The softer it gets. I don't know, and I'm going to have to Google this, but one side is leather and one side is suede. Both fake. <laughs> <laughs> Both fake. Let me get out of here before I get us shut down by somebody. <laughs> There's going to be people standing outside tomorrow. All we the signs. eat plants, not animals. <laughs> oh, Christine. All right. Oh, I didn't put shoes on. Oops. Okay. We'll do this one without shoes. All right. Here All right. we go. I'm going to get comments. 
I'm just short without any shoes on. <laughs> um, all right, next up is the Can't Fight It Corduroy Dress in Berry. And this dress released several weeks ago. It has been a hit. Some of you might already have it. It makes a really cute dress when you have it snapped, um, but it also makes a cute little jacket. Um, you could wear it either way. It's fun because it's a really versatile piece and you can wear it a lot of different ways over leggings, over some fun little tights, but you can also just wear it coat style and have a little bit of a longer coat cardigan look to it. So this is, what color do we call this? Berry. Berry. Berry, which is like, it's a very, very Christmas. It's a very, very Christmas, um, which I really love <laughs> with this kind of vintage. I think the colors just went well together. So I thought it was a cute option. Um, so true to size in this piece, I think almost everybody has opted to stay true to size. There's elastic in the waist. So if you do opt to wear this one buttoned and wear it as a dress, um, staying true to size works. If you like a little bit more room, of course I have this layered over teen. I've got jeans underneath here, which I don't typically have. I wasn't getting any pocket puckering without jeans and all those things underneath. Um, if you like to have a little bit more room in this midsection, then you could size up one, but otherwise you can stay true to size. And... It's just fantastic. I don't know what else I was going to say about this. But I don't know either. It's a really cute layer for this time of year. That's what I guess I was going to say. Okay. That's what you were okay. going to say. And then, new graphic tee here. This Merry Christmas with the vintage car uh, and tree. It is just, I think this is kind of like, like photos that just sticks around and is printed and put up in houses and things. I it's one the of those. The car or the truck with the tree is like my Christmas yes, theme. Yes, it's so cute and just a really good one. So again, Bella Canvas tee, same fit as that last one. These are all the same blend. I think 50% cotton, 25 poly, put 25 rayon. Rayon. Yeah, I think that's what blend they are. That info is on the website. Christine made sure it was there, right? <laughs> I got a thumbs up with a <laughs> okay, so I think it's on the website. I think I clicked through most of them. I'll go look. <laughs> um, but a Heather Green on this one. So really cute. And then, oh, I threw on these fun little earrings. I love these because these are a 3D. So that little tree is 3D on it, but it has that fun paint splatter background. Cork and leather bonded together, super lightweight, come in a couple of different colors. Um, all of these you'll be able to find on the site. And then also in that, like I said, in the holiday collection as well, you'll be able to find all of the earrings. So cuteness. So I'm going to change yes, because, because I didn't, didn't check. Really you didn't check what? I didn't check that they were all there. Oh my gosh, this one's not there? No, actually that one is. Oh. Another one isn't. Great. I know. Just great. You're just made out of fabric. I made out of fabric, you guys. If there was any question. Vegan fabric. Vegan fabric. It is also fake fabric. Can you buy what this are you gonna for do? me, please? It's fake fabric. Both of them. I don't know. Both of them. That way I have to help you back out of it too. Fantastic. Thank you. What are you looking for? I'm just making sure that they're all the same and that I get oh. the bun. All of them. All right. You're welcome. Oh, God. I almost slipped out of my chair. <laughs> Listen, pleather on pleather. You're going to wear this to the office and you have a pleather chair. Careful how you sit. I did the steaming today and I didn't do a great job of the stack line. Yes, she, don't sit I'm leather on leather. She might fall. Um, okay, this is another good one. I love this too. Not holiday specific, but a really great Christmas green color paired here with these fun holly petal earrings uh, that are already on the site. Leather, not vegan leather. These are leather. <laughs> um, and genuine leather, two and a half inches, total length, super lightweight easy. And then I'll tell you my jeans in just a second, Kimberly, because I did forget with the last outfit. I am in the, it must be you quilted pullover size small through three X is what this comes in. I am shown in the small and it is a slightly relaxed fit, but super comfy and cute. And it has pockets. I didn't even realize. So oh, that's there's... a fun little detail there. The pockets and what's nice is they do kind of just blend in. They don't pucker or they're not bulky in there even realize that it had pockets um cute little keyhole with the double button here on the back of that little like mock collar 
quilted and I, it's not actually it's not quilted i, I know it's, it kept it looks me off in the yeah name. oh did i call it quilted yeah i think it looked quilted probably maybe you want to take that out of the name sure because that's not it's just a textured material quilted sometimes scares people because we know that quilted doesn't always have stretch right Gru? i excuse me <laughs> but yeah he and i both know all right so we both super know. cool kind of a little bubble 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 uh text sure i can't even say her face shyla so far i don't believe that we've seen this in other colors no this is the very first of this um so banded bottom but it's not real snug but it does like help it kind of stay in at your hips and not just a line has a cute little shape to it again slightly relaxed fit so sizing is down is going to be optional or i'd say don't size down unless you're in between sizes if you 50% of the time do a medium, 50% of the time do a small, then you can size down. Fabric content, 95% polyester, 5% spandex. Jeans that I have on. Um, What are these called? Judy Blue Buttonfly Trouser Flare. Judy Blue Buttonfly Trouser Flare. These are a, what inseam? Let's see, 32 and a half inch inseam and a 10.75 inch rise. So, um, Buttonfly cute, easy, nice, dark, like dark wash, medium wash, I guess I would say with that little bit of like the hand sanded front and no distressing on these. So if you don't do distressing, these have none, no distressing anywhere, not little bits on the pockets or anything. So they are fantastic. Fun when you do a little front tuck with something to show your little button fly off, but they are super comfy, run true to duty blue sizing. I'm in my normal 728 and this is the size that I would stay in these. So, hey, I'm gonna change. Bye. 42 outfits left. <laughs> They're going to start believing you. <laughs> I'm just joking. Know. They're going to know. How are they going to know? How will they know? How will they know? They won't know. That's the fun of it. Surprise. Lori, I would do the 1X in that top. I am a one X in almost all tops here. Are you? Yeah. I am. Okay. All right. Here we go. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. All right. This is another pretty one that we liked for the holiday season. Um, that is just your great, a great white. Again, you can pair it with a colored bottom if you want, or a fun shoe for a pop of color, but this one is really fun. And I honestly, when I put this on, I was a little surprised at like how much I liked the fit of it. She had zero faith in it. I was concerned before. because it's a different fabric than what we'd be used to. It has a little bit more of like a fleecy feel on the outside. It's almost like sweatshirt inside out, which I did not anticipate from photos of it beforehand. And then I was worried because the lace has no stretch to it. So as soon as I like went to tug on it, I was like, there is no way I'm getting that small on these arms, but I did. And it is not too tight. It is very comfortable. This material having stretch is really nice because it doesn't feel too snug across the back, but this has just a cute little, little, um, like puff sleeve to it there at the top. I think it needed to be flipped a little bit out of the packaging. You could see all the, like the little creases, but like a cute little fluff to it. And then nicely length, not exceptionally long, but a good length. So it's hitting me like right below my wrist bone. And then a slightly relaxed fit here with some stretch to this material. So I love this nut cut of this neckline. It's not too low. It's just a really pretty top that is again not holiday specific but a nice one for the holiday season that you can pull in something fun but like this lacy detail on this material is really cute i think it's just a really fun piece cute to do a little front tuck with if you'd like um and then like i said i just threw on the dixie ann boot with this but you can throw on a fun colored boot if you want i put on some little nomi nomi elves or santas i don't know i think these are just gnomes yeah little gnomes. gnomes with that red glitter for a little fun something the white sequin boot yes would be so pretty with this you know and we didn't keep all of the sequin boots in the live room here um i wanted to keep them protected and and all that jazz they went back to their homes and their boxes very quickly yes <laughs> 
We didn't want any sequins to become a casualty of our chaos. Yes. And they really aren't. I mean, I've had my Katie pair for over a year and have worn them for a lot of things, packed them for several trips and not had any issues with any sequins coming off at all. But I was like, that would just be like our luck. We would pick them up and move them 20 times in this room to different places and then end up having, having some sort of issue. Yeah, so some of them off. Yeah. So we just put them back in their boxes for safety. That white sweater would be fabulous with these vegan leather pants. Yeah, it that. would. It would. Okay. Yes, Paula, true to size on that top. Yes, very true to size. I was shown in the small. That's the size I would stick with. I would not suggest sizing down in it, but yeah, it's great. All right, next up, you guys, is the Trim the Tree sweater. This is available in small through 3X, and this is a fun one. I love the little pop of pink that you get with this one. So um, this has got to have vis viscose in it or something. Oh, it's nylon, but man, that feels like viscose. So 52% rayon, 29% polyester, 19% nylon, super soft medium weight. Um, it is extremely soft. Like I said, feels like there's viscose in it and slightly relaxed fit, a little bit of that like Dolman style cut where it hugs my hips a wee bit. I'd say very similar fit to the first, uh, reindeer one, which they're the same brand. So that would make sense. Um, but cute details with these fun little trees. Some of them are decorated. Some of them are not, uh, but just a cute holiday sweater for something different. So I would say stay true to size. Those in between sizes could size down if you wanted to. Um, but you don't have to feel like that little bit of a roomy fit. Then you can stay true to size. This one may it's be my so favorite cute. one from tonight's lineup. I know. It's so different with the pink, and I love that. I know. And this one, too, we have some adorable earrings that are coming to match all of these. Me oh, me. So, yeah, adorable. Okay, I'm changing. Okay, bye. That one makes me very happy. I know. The I pink is so love fun. It. I love it. I love it. You have, do you have quite the outfit change now? Because did you yeah. say it's an iron thing? Um, Rachel failed. Uh, to mention earlier, if you are waiting on, still, most of them should be done, your shipping credit from oh. Deal or No Deal. Oh, I failed to. We didn't even talk failed about Failed to it. mention. <laughs> so, um, we have commented ever since Friday and Deal or No Deal starts that if you overpay in shipping, once we know your exact shipping prices, we will only charge you for exact shipping. Um, so I started to the grueling process today <laughs> of going through 2,100 orders <laughs> and looking at what everybody paid for shipping and then what their actual shipping costs are, were, is, and issuing the gift cards. I am about halfway through, maybe a little more than half. So if you haven't gotten that gift card yet, it will be issued by the end of the day tomorrow. And did it kind of go by what order they paid their very first invoice? Yeah, it's so you guys, the way that, that this all works while Rachel's still getting ready. I'm sorry. Is that if you continue to shop throughout the weekend, so like let's say you just had one invoice from Friday night, then you would be in the very beginning of the list of what I was going through. And if you had multiple from the weekend and paid closer, like paid your last invoice closer to the end of the night, Sunday night, when we merged all of our orders together, it would have pushed you up or down. Oh, or so out it wasn't based of the off list. of when they paid their first invoice. Yeah, it was. Oh, it was. Well, yeah, kind of yes and no. I don't know. It's just like a whole thing. It's just the whole thing. And I'm more than halfway done. So by tomorrow, it will be all done and you will get your gift cards by the end of the day. And like I said, if you um, don't see one and you think that you should have one, feel free to email anybody other than me. <laughs> <laughs> that means me. <laughs> Oh, no, I meant anybody other than the boutique. Oh. <laughs> no, it shoot me a PM or the business page text or us, text, text us, us 999 I think that works so good. She's talking over the number. 
<laughs> we didn't really want them to text. Yeah. So. <laughs> I think texting was great though, because we got your messages. Those go to both Christine and myself. Um, and then if the girls are here at the boutique, it goes to them too. So you have two earrings in one ear. <laughs> and both of them? No, just the one. Oh no, both. I <laughs> Christy, if you guys are still watching on Facebook, Christy commented, I need people who only ordered one thing to send me a private message and let me know how you manage such amazing self-control. <laughs> Gift cards are via email. Yes, they are. They yes. will go to your email address on file. With and us. those never expire. And if you've, if you've lost one, let us know. One thing about gift cards is that they're fantastic for you guys. They are awful for me at the end of the year with taxes. So use them. <laughs> use them i think use last year in like right october away. november i one day i took like an entire day and i reset all the outstanding gift cards and i was like please use these please use these please use these um so make sure you use them if you think you have some from a return from whatever point in time they don't expire so we still have it in our system let me know and we can resend it to you but you can use those that way my Text me and I'll be happier with you. <laughs> You'll be kinder. Um, and one other thing about what was I going to say about deal or no deal? Um, I'm not sure. Don't don't even know. Don't even know. Okay. Next up, I'm in the forever yours quilted jacket. This is one you guys have seen on several lives now. If you have not figured out, I love it. Um, it is fantastic. Such a great layer. Again, medium weight, so not super heavy. If you live somewhere where doing a really heavy coat this time of year or come Christmas party time is just not feasible, this is a great layer that's not super duper heavy or it's a nice one that you can wear inside during a party as well. Um, it's just a really great piece. Runs very true to size and shown in the small. This gorgeous quilted uh, detail also comes in black. So if black is more your jam, uh, you can go either way, the beige or the black. Available in sizes extra small through 3X. So it does come in a smaller size than what I'm shown in. Uh, for you tiny little ladies, you can snatch up the extra small as well. But it's just the best. I absolutely love it. Just drape front, no button closure or anything like that to have to worry about. So sizing is slightly flexible. Um, does have some stretch in it. If you're going to layer over anything long sleeve, a little bit thicker, I would suggest just staying true to size and not messing around with sizing down at all. But it is a fantastic piece and just gorgeous. Yeah, it is. A, it is gorgeous. It's a beautiful piece. I love it. I love the quilted on the angle um, and then how the angles go opposite directions. It just really is constructed so well and has fantastic little details to it. So love this piece. Great for holiday time. And then um, this little dress is superb. And I'm going to really try to like not flash at anyone. I feel like it's so <laughs> low, but my pictures when I like stood, I was like, oh, um, okay, this dress is called the Rise Above It Long Sleeve Midi Dress in Hunter Green. Available in small through 2X. This comes in XL and 1X. Previously released in black, which we do still have black available. Uh, this is just a cute, cute little dress. Again, love it for holiday time. But this green, just being solid, makes it so you can wear it anytime. Um, tiered skirt here, relaxed fit, nice fit up in the chest. Um, now this one, if you got the black, we had talked about it when I tried it on originally and it's tacked like right here and then it puckered funny. And I, we kind of throughout the live decided that that needed to be, that tack needed to be taken out just like if it was tacked in, um, like a slit in the bottom of a skirt or pockets in a jacket that are tacked. This was tacked here and it really did a weird puckering thing. If you've gotten the black one and you're like, why does it pucker like that? This little tack in there needs to come out, which we did with this one um, just a little bit ago. And it's a much prettier fit. It doesn't pull across the chest and have like this weird little bubble gap there. So that little tack needs to come out, um, which does then make this a lower cut. So if I had planned properly, realizing that it would make it lower cut, I would have thrown on a little camisole with it, a little lace cami or something underneath. So that way it gave me a little bit more coverage. If you like low cut and if you've got the chest for it, kudos to you. Pull, you can pull it off. I mean, it's not like down to your navel. So it just, for me, is a little bit low, but super cute. Love this. Um, love the little ruffle details. This one, I suggest staying true to size in um, because, again, it has a really nice fit here. If you size down, it's going to really pull that chest, and then you might see your navel or more than what you want to see. <laughs> <laughs> little double ruffle collar here. Oh, boy, I almost just showed you guys more than what I wanted you to see. Um, and then a fun little smocked 
uh, band here at the wrist to keep that in place. This is just a really pretty piece. I love it for holiday time. And if you have weddings over the next month, you know, or so, this would be a really good dress to wear to a wedding. I threw on our, oh my gosh, I almost like showed you more than I wanted to see up there too. Um, these fun, what do we call these? The lacy tights. The lacy tights um, and that we have on our website now are so fun for something a little bit different when you don't want to just wear nylons or a legging. Is it really appropriate? These are a fun detail. So you have that fun lacy. Now, this is the pair that I only showed you guys rosy on me um, because I was like, well, I have one open here. Why keep opening more? Um, but I have put these on and off probably a dozen or more times and I have not caught anything. I've not snagged them. There are no issues at all um, with the, the quality of them going on and off and on and off and on and off. I have not washed them yet. I would wash them in a, um, like a machine bag, machine wash a bag, bag, a laundry bag. Thank you. I would wash them in a laundry bag so they don't get caught on other things. But I mean, for on and off, you would think at one point I would have caught my toes in them and like destroyed them, but I haven't. So they're fantastic. Cute with a little booty or I threw on the Adrena boot here, which is a wedge. Um, and I like a tall boot for winter time with the dress just because it keeps me a little bit warmer, but it'd be really cute with a booty or a fancier little shoe too. Something sparkly would be pretty with this as well. Do a lot of different things, a lot of different shoe options with this dress. Love what? Her. Nothing. Can you come out here with that tact like that? Show them what we're talking yeah, about. I am. Okay. Well, you're to. up. I'm going to. Um, so I own all six pair of the tights. I couldn't help myself. And I needed one of every style. And I have caught my wedding ring in them. And I haven't ripped them. Um, my puppy found a pair. <laughs> And chewed on them. You know how tights always come with that cardboard insert? Apparently she was really drawn to the cardboard. And she chewed and she chewed and she chewed. And I opened them up, pulled the cardboard out of it, washed them in a laundry bag, and they don't have holes. I mean, it's just like there's... It's because they already had holes. They already had holes. But, like, not like... You've seen the girls in fishnets walking down the street and, like, you know that hole wasn't supposed to be there. <laughs> They're a diamond pattern, but that big old hole right here... <laughs> Listen, pretty woman, nobody is paying. Go change. All right. Um, so they really are great quality. They can withstand all kinds of wear and tear and stretch on their little fibers. So this is what Rachel was talking about. This fantastic little tack that is in all of the dresses and the black ones. We did not take mine out. So when you don't take it out, you get this little pucker because it obviously wants to open up further. This is available in small through 2X with an extra large and a 1X. I am in the very staticky extra large. So like it's sticking to all of the curves, how it's not supposed to, um, but I'm very comfortable. Do you like that? It just stays. I'm very comfortable in the extra large. This is the size that I would stay in. I have just a little bit of extra room under the bust. So, I mean, honestly, this pull of the tack isn't even because it's making it too tight. It's just not supposed to be there. The fabric isn't supposed to lay that way. So it pulls this part funny. If we had taken the tack out, it would have laid properly like Rachel's does. If we had static guard it, it would lay properly like Rachel's <laughs> does. But I mean, the extra large, super comfy. This is the size that I would stay in. No size flexing necessary. I'll go get the next comment and see in a little bit. Yeah, so you guys were in this little like not holiday specific wear series because I ended up scooching everything around where normally I'll mix in all the tees and sweatshirts and things throughout, but I ended up scooching it all last minute. So don't worry. We've got a ton of holiday graphic tees and sweatshirts and ampersands and all that jazz coming in just a bit. Um, okay. Oh, y'all hopped over here to the app. I see you all moving. I know they are. <laughs> um, okay, this is another absolutely. As soon as I put this on, Christine's like, I just love that. It is so good. This is so fun. It is a button down dress. Uh, so it buttons all the way. I probably could button this one so that I don't feel like I have to hold it closed. Um, 
I made my true size small. This is a size I would for sure stick with. It is fantastic. And I, you guys, I just learned today officially, I can say how to tie a bow the right way so that it's not like this. Like it doesn't have one side like standing up and look like show that. Everybody? I don't know. I don't know if I can repeat it. Mm -hmm. They all are probably like, duh, we know how to do it. But it like actually lays right instead of like all funky. I don't even know how to explain it. But it's fantastic. <laughs> so cute little belt on this one. You can wear it with or without. Uh, the belt comes off. So you can definitely wear it without. Little side slits on this. And then buttons down to a really great, it's right like right above my knee. Oh, I actually don't even have this button, bottom one button. Right, but right above the knee. So it's a very modest. You can obviously unbutton it if you want to be not so modest um, and have that unbuttoned more. But true to size fit, great sleeve length on this one. Fantastic feeling material. Feels really good. Oh, my collar's popped all crazy. Um, cute little just traditional collar on this. Again, adding some really fun holiday accessories. Earrings can make this a great holiday piece. Fabric content, 54% rayon, 40% nylon, 6% spandex. Also has snack holes. So cute little detail there. I absolutely adore this. I think it is such a flattering fit and such a cute piece. So cute with the Adrena tall boot. But again, you can wear it with a short booty um, as well if you don't do a tall boot. But it is, it's beautiful. This is a great piece. Super easy. If you work somewhere where you dress up, you can wear this all day um, without issue. It is just fantastic. And honestly, um, it did not require much when it came to steaming. So if you are somebody who doesn't do a lot of ironing and steaming, I think that nylon in it really helped keep that more of a wrinkle-free material where it needed very light detail, light, light steaming to it. So beautiful piece, nice little flowiness, very true to size, I would say. Let me take this belt off so that way you guys can see how relaxed it is um, in the small with that unbelted. So definitely plenty of room in this where it looked more fitted, but it's de it's definitely relaxed. You could throw on too if you wanted to do a fun belt, a different color, something holiday-ish. Uh, Belt-wise, you could throw on with this too um, to switch it up. Or even just like a thicker brown belt would be fun with it. So it is absolutely beautiful. Christina's putting this on. Is that what I'm reading? Yes. Let's see if I can show you how to do the tie. So I don't do like the little rabbit ears. But if you go around and then normally I would come up right here. And see how like, this would be like my normal bow. And I keep like flipping it and I'm like, okay, how do I get it to lay the right way? Well, I guess that, can, no, see it doesn't. Like if I let it go, it's gonna end up looking like this. Let's see if I can replicate it. I've done it now like four times this evening. We'll see if I can do it on camera the right way. So, did I go? oh yeah, so I went opposite. So instead of going around this way, I came around the bottom. So instead of going around the top, I went around the bottom. And then, I don't know how to show this. When I put this through the hole, I put it above the tail that I have hanging here. Is this a really good demonstration? Y'all are learning a lot. But it's basically the same thing, just the opposite direction. What is that? Was that, did that make sense? Everybody got it? Everybody's got it. Everybody figured it out. Everybody's got it. Yes, do I put this on? <laughs> Great. Best tutorial on making a bow the right way. Fantastic. <laughs> I think that that should probably, this would be like a TikTok viral on like how to make the like bow. I'd viral, be like, right? see, see, let me see. Let me you. see it. Let go of it. How'd you do it right? I don't know. Did you know. go around the bottom instead? See, that's what I figured I out. Don't instead know. of over top. So that's what I always do. Over the top. I always go over the top. You have to go over through the through the bottom. Like this. Like so. Like that. Swipe left. Oh, is that for comments? Swipe left. How can I watch this without comments? Swipe them off the screen. Why can you that? on the app you can without? I don't know. Mine has like a little comment off button in the bottom left hand corner of my screen. Do you have that where there's comments? No comments. You have that on yours? I don't know. Go look at it. Bye. That was the most confusing oh, no, no, you don't. tutorial I've ever seen. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. Swipe left. Does take it away. Just not on mine. Swipe or no swiping. 
swiping left work. Look, I just don't like understand what she's talking down arrow about swipes. going from the bottom. Oh my god. You know what our parents didn't do when we were kids? We never had like the the buddy around the tree loop swoop and tie your shoe. We were just <laughs> screamed at until our shoes were tied. Why is Facebook so pixelated? I don't know. So we don't have this cute little saying to learn how to tie shoes and bows and we just tie them until we think they're right. <laughs> Well, my bow is working. Oh. You would think with as many bows we would as we tie in a day, she would have an idea how to tie a bow. No, I tie regular ribbon on a package that's different. That's cute. Yes, we you, know I who guess. ties a better bow. That's cute on you, I guess. Um, okay, so this is available small through 3X with an extra large and a 1X. And you know, I'm honestly thinking that. I don't know. Maybe if I undo that one, it's not as, I feel like I'm getting some puckering across the bust. And so I feel like for the bust, I would size up to the one X. It's comfy. And I don't feel like, I don't know what she just hit, but she hit something. She's probably trying to tie bows. I've got room back here. So it's not that it's too tight there, but I almost think that it has more to do with the width of my shoulders that this sits a little off and so it's pulling through my bust here so i am in the extra large and i really just think it's because i carry my weight in my hips and my shoulders she didn't hear it you she's carry? ignoring me <laughs> i was waiting i've been waiting for you her to hear it <laughs> I was waiting for her to hear it. Um, but I do have broader shoulders. And so I think part of that is that it's pulling this just a little bit across the top. Now, if I, to make this really Christmassy, and if I wanted to stay in the extra large, I would get one of the triple crisscross camis and the Kelly green and have that crisscross up through here. And then I could even unbutton one further because this is the type of dress then since it buttons all the way down the front, I love to wear these as like dusters and cardigan style jackets through the winter as well with leggings and something cute. So I probably would stay in the extra large because I can manipulate this piece many different ways. And so then to wear it as a dress, I would do it with a knee high boot. It's and then so cute. that Kelly green triple crisscross cami for Christmas. And then, I mean, you could even go like black, white, some other very basic color to get you through the rest of the season. But yeah, I am in an extra large. This is available in a 1X. So if you strictly want to wear it as a dress and you're bustier, it's not going to hurt to go up one size, especially because it's got this belted waist. You can still cinch it in to give yourself a shape without it feeling too tight or like when you sit down you're gonna blow a button somewhere so blow a button <laughs> whoa what? what are you doing to my laptop Just what is you doing nothing what are you doing get out of here Go show I'm just some doing clothes. all the things that I didn't get to do earlier. Go do something. All right. Last cute little combo, and then we are going to get into the holiday um, graphic tees and all that fun stuff. You know what? I just wanted you to know when thinking about tying these bows, um, I was working on my gift wrapping skills earlier in this week, and I was hoping to get a gig somewhere to do some holiday wrapping, but Christine said nobody would hire me. So, if she this all won goes through, very specific place, <laughs> Christine, she <laughs> wanted Barb. to hire her at Herman. I said while I was rapping, do you think there was, Barb and Christine would hire me? Absolutely not. Not only is she tape waist twelve, her creases weren't even, and there was extra paper. <laughs> I was wasteful with my paper. Yeah. Lisa, um, yes, the sleeves you unbutton and roll that you could roll them. Uh, Jenny, I put that, I showed that dress without the belt. Christine didn't, but I did. Um, nice roomy 
fit. Okay, next up, I'm in the Make a Connection blouse in Hunter Green. This is available in small through 3X. This might look familiar to you because it also came in hot, hot, hot pink, um, which actually restocked today. So if you've been waiting for the hot pink, the restock is here. You can snatch that up. Um, but then this is the Kelly Green. I absolutely adore this top. I have the hot pink one myself, and it is superb. Um, such a cute top. Fun little bit of, it's not even... I'm like, it's not even, is it stretchy? No, it's not even smocked. It just has that cute little gathered detail there at the shoulder, which gives it just a little bit of structure. Um, and then a fun loose fit, kind of balloon sleeve, a little button detail here with then this like just cute, easy cuff detail on it. Um, and let me untuck it so y'all can see. Slightly relaxed fit on this. True to size. Very true to size. We do not suggest sizing down on this one. It is superb. If you have the hot pink, it's the same fit and such a great top. And we got the Kelly Green after the hot pink was such a hit. And I was like, this green is going to be perfect for the holidays. And not Kelly Green, Hunter Green. Definitely more Hunter Green than it is Kelly Green. It's a true Christmas green. But I love this combo. These earrings, I think, have gone with the last three outfits that I put on, but such a cute one with that paint splatter background. You get a little bit of silver and black there and it's just fun. I have it paired with the belted shorts. What are these called? Oh, I'm sorry. They are the crazy about you belted shorts. Crazy about you belted shorts. Can you come out here with that unbelted when I'm changing in my next outfit? Ginny, she'll come back out so you can see it unbelted on her. Um, crazy about you belted shorts available in small through three X come in XL and one X. I am shown in my true size medium. These are a comfortable fit um, with roominess here. So I have plenty of room in the pockets and in my hips. If you like a more relaxed fit on your waist, size up one. I could do the large just fine with a little bit more room in my waist, which I'm more comfortable with. If you like something that's more fitted, stay in your normal short pant size. When it comes to a letter, letter size, stick with that one. The medium really is a nice fit else all other places, but I just in my waist like that wee bit of extra room. So crazy about you belted shorts available in small through three X. Perfect little Christmas combo. Love it again with the tight um, and again, I have it still paired with these Adrenos because I've left them on because I'm lazy, but doing it with, um, a short booty would be cute as well. Christine's going to come out here with this unbelted. <laughs> Under his eye. <laughs> All right. Without a belt, I do have, let me raise the... <laughs> Well, you have it still like cinched. So. I'm trying not to. I'm trying to, like... not to. <laughs> what? I just, I just she just wants to off? see it. I didn't know if I should just take it off. <laughs> <laughs> All she asked was to see it unbelted. There it is, unbelted. But I actually liked now that I've taken the belt off. Now that I've unbelted it. Um, oh, I got the back of it stuck. <laughs> um, I was looking and I actually like if I just do one loop with this, so it still cinches it in just a little bit underneath the bus, so you have some shape. But if you really, really don't want that, you can loosen this all the way up. And so it's just more of a shirt dress. Um, and then snap clothes in there, but it won't be too fitted that way. All right, great. I don't know what else to do. <laughs> there was a request hands. for you to try on the green top. Oh, was there? Yes, there was. Oh, I see it. Yeah. Sorry, I left the room, and then I got confused. Crazy. Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Why can't I think of anything else? It's been a while. I have. I stopped watching that show. I know, but I stopped before it was finished. It lost its luster. She really got crazy. Like, beyond, like, just crazy, crazy, like, now you're just being ridiculous. Yeah. I'm going to put comments up, and then I will be back in that green shirt. I Is promise. this right that there are only three different ones? I will look. 
I felt like I loaded more, but that could be because every size had its own line. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Yes, three. Okay. I'm gonna show them these. I guess I'm gonna open them myself too. Goodness. All right. Just gotta do all the things. Just do over all here. the stuff. Get no help. Oh, I just a minute, help. guys, and then I'll show you something else new. I'll put your comment up so I can go change. Because it's almost you. You would think I like almost had nothing around here. <laughs> All right, new slippies this year. If you guys remember, we had these last year, and they were such a huge hit. But we had some different um, prints. There's some different little guys on them. So this year we have these fun little gingerbread and the reindeer are adorable. The little Rudolphs and these run true to size. They come in three different sizes, small, medium, medium, large, large, extra large. Size suggestions for these are on the website down in the details of what sizing suggestion is for these. I wear a medium large. I'm an eight and a half. They fit great. Um, and they are the softest, comfiest, have a hard bottom sole on them. Um, and they are just super luscious. We also had these for Valentine's Day. We had a series of them. Um, and maybe just a couple other random prints as well, but they are a favorite. A lot of people who snatched them up last year at Christmas got them again when they came in the Valentine's prints too. So these are adorable. They are releasing today. Come in those two. And then this one, same brand, so same fit details, have a hard sole, but these are more of a, a fuzzy kind, like a faux fur, um, vegan fur, a faux fur, soft Sherpa. Sherpa? Is that what they're called? Um, but really soft. So same, like I said, same company, same brand, all that. And then the little Santa face on there. So these are adorable. They're all really comfortable and they have a nice cushy footbed on them. So they are great. So these are also releasing today and I just love them. They are the coziest, cutest little things. So those are new for the holidays. And then we have a new sweatshirt in. Yeah, it's getting hot in this room. I turned the heat off a little bit ago, but it's hot. This says, it's the most wonderful time of the year on this cute solid white tee that then has the uh, color splash detail to it. It's not bleaching. I'm used to saying like bleach detail. This one has the color with the red and the green. And then I loved these earrings with it. Like the most perfect match are these little paint splatter ones with the red and green background on the white and just a true to size unisex fit sweatshirt. So slightly relaxed fit, true to size. We would not suggest sizing up unless you want it to be oversized, fit a little bit longer, all that. But this is just a fun one, the most wonderful time of the year. Love the little ornament on there. Yeah, that covers this one. So I'm gonna change. I'll talk about my shoes or my shoes that I don't have on in a minute. When I get them on. Oh, I was gonna put this early. Oh yes. But I need your help, I think. It has the sweetest little daintiest clip. I know you should have. We realized that we're sorry, we're 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 coming. I e me. I'm just waiting for Rachel to learn how to put a necklace on. I think she's intentionally trying to choke me. Okay, the, her nails are in the way. Her, her nails. Her nails are in the way. All right, listen, I won't have her put it on. I'll hold it here. Well, I broke a nail, which is not helping. She broke a nail, which is not helping. Okay, so I'm holding this in place. Let me put it, these, this, but I'm gonna have these. Let me show it up closer. These are gorgeous, gorgeous layering necklaces from our friends over at Herman Hiss. Perfect for the holidays perfect for asking for um, to be in wrapped under the tree to be in. <laughs> <laughs> I bite my nails and Rachel has a broken nail. And so 
We're both doing really, really well with clasps. So, oh my goodness, if I could get it to hang right. What is our problem tonight? Just my hands. Just her hands. Let me try again. She thinks she's got it this Got it. What, just, why was the other one I so much more difficult? Nail, like, in the clasp of better. Oh my goodness. Look at how pretty that is. I think you put it on me backwards. No, I didn't. Did I? No, she didn't. <laughs> I'm just messing with her. I'm just messing with her. Okay, let me grab our little sheet now that we've got them on. These are the perfect layering necklace. So obviously you can wear it with any length, even the necklaces that Rachel is always wearing. This is going to sit just above her bar that everybody loves. It is available in a round, an emerald, a pear, or an oval. And they range, you can get them quarter carat up to three quarter carat size. Um, and it says lab grown diamond, Christine, if I miss anything or I say it wrong, correct me. They're available in white gold and yellow gold. So just absolutely stunning. Let me turn this one back around again so that you can see this is the emerald cut. Ooh, look at me. I know the shape of something really easy when I know this How is the pear. Well, because this is the pear. Is it shaped like a pear? And there is a round and there's an oval. And this is neither of the above. So process of elimination says it has to be the emerald. In white gold. You know why I know that? Because this one's yellow gold. <laughs> they're available from our friends over at Herman Hiss. And again, they're available in quarter, half, or three-quarter carat lab grown diamond but just so pretty for layering all the different lengths and of necklaces shape can be made in any one of those sizes yes and they are running a website update right now so they should be available i have a hair somewhere i have a straight hair somewhere they should be available tomorrow christine let us know that their website was still updating tonight just before we went live um so don't hop on the website looking for them tonight not able to find them and give up hope they'll be there tomorrow will they be under your picks yes they will be under our picks but again they'll be on the website tomorrow after their website is done updating um she's kicking things okay the make a connection blouse the same as the hot pink why? She's looking at me funny. In the emerald green. I'm in the 1X. Sorry, I wouldn't still be out here if she hadn't been trying to choke me with diamonds. <laughs> I suppose there are worse ways to go. But I'm in the 1X. This is my true size. And this this blue out here in the hot pink. Don't forget to snatch up the restock and get it in this gorgeous emerald green to get through the holidays. Maybe you should take some advice from your earrings. <laughs> They say jolly. Apparently she thinks I need more jolly. Yes, I do. All right. <clears throat> well, this little guy here is fun and cute. What is this called? This is the called the Can't We Just Have Fun flannel button down. And then discovered today that this little button down is like more of a coat. Not weight wise, still flannel button down weight. So it's not super heavy, but it has these fun little like drawstrings on the inside that you could, you know, set to whatever. Oh my goodness, show everybody how to tie a bow. I'll spare you. <laughs> so I have this one cinched in, this side not, um, just to show you that you can kind of give it a little waistline if you would like. I love the length of this. It's a little bit longer, more tunicky, so it will be cute with leggings and slightly oversized. So roomy sleeves, cute little raw edges, like really just raw edge details on here. And let's see, little pockets on the outside. What else? What else? I think that's about it. A little curved hemline. Again, lots of those raw edge details on it on this flannel. Just a great classic and white black plaid. 
but you can cinch that little side into how you'd like it, which I love. And then again, if you live somewhere warmer, you could wear this more as a coat um, where it's not super thick, not a real heavy material or weight. And it's a cute piece. So cinching it in, I love that. Wear it either way, whichever you prefer. And it's true to size. I would say I'm in the small. If you're going to want to cinch it in, I would say stay true to size because that gives you the ability to kind of form fit it to how you'd like it on your waist. Um, if you are not going to do that and you just want it to be a relaxed fit, I think sizing down would be fine uh, because it is a little bit of a roomier fit. But yeah, this is a cute piece. Not a collar on this one. It has a little bit or mock collar, I guess, but not a fold over traditional collar on it. But it is a Adorable. I love this. And then I love it layered over a lot of different graph tees that we have today. It's kind of hard to choose because there are so many good ones to pick from. So love the details, true to size, fabric content, 100% polyester on that. And then we are going to whip through some graphic tees and layering pieces real quick. Not layering pieces, sweatshirts and things so that way you guys can see all these goodies and we can keep moving because I see what time it is. Then I gotta go fast. Um, loving this graphic tee, black background or black. Bella Canvas T says Marian Bright and then has all these fun like drawn ornaments almost looks like garland with the ornaments in it. This is a fun one. This is from that brand. We've gotten a lot of these that are actually they're by Kellyanne is who the artist is that draws them. So you probably can recognize that style art and that we've had other pieces for other holidays um, with this. So it's just a fun one. I love the pops of color on that black. A little bit more of like your limey green, bright green and red on this one. Um, so these earrings were a cute, cute combo there to pull in. So true size on the graphic tee, 50% cotton, 50% polyester, 50% rayon. That's 150% of a shirt. <laughs> <laughs> 50% cotton, 25% polyester, 25% There you go. <laughs> That's 150% of a shirt. Not great at math, okay? <laughs> Your invoice is wrong this weekend. It was probably me. <laughs> Not great at math. Oh, man. When we were on vacation, it didn't last long, but when we were on vacation, because the kids are in school right now, Rachel brought their books and their homework. And... Blake and I did his math homework together one morning and Matt, I love math. It's black and white. The answer is the answer. That's the answer. Kathy will get to the genes, I promise. But he was doing that common core and he would be like eight plus four minus 11 plus 32, six. And I'm like, How? what? <laughs> Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the answer. Yeah, but I don't get what you've done. I don't understand why. <laughs> um, all right. I love this one, too, for a little pop of red under here. I just like this combo, so I want to throw it on real quick so you guys can see that as well. But this is a cute tea. It says, shimmy, shimmy, cocoa, what? Shimmy, shimmy, cocoa, what? <laughs> Which is a cute one. Little mug of hot cocoa with the star on it, or star, the snowflake on it. Just simple. Simple, but a cute, cute little graphic tee. This one's a different fabric content. I'm going to have to look at it because I can't see uh, it. Um, not a Bella Canvas tee. So I have a little bit less, a little bit less of that relaxed. It almost feels like there's slightly more cotton in it. Doesn't say. I did not know if that was one that so, I hadn't gotten to checking yet. Could still stick with staying in your true to size because it's not super snug. But if you like that little bit more relaxed fit, then I would suggest going up one. 100% cotton. 100% cotton. Sorry, I had to read through 13 languages to find English. <laughs> so yeah, up to you if you want to size up one. I would say if you like that roomier fit. If you're going to dry it, it's safe to size up the one. Um, Okay. What jeans do I have on? Let's talk about those real quick. Judy Blue Contrast Wash Boyfriend Jeans. Okay, I have the Judy Blue Contrast Wash Boyfriend Jeans on. Now, I do have these cuffed multiple times because of the little boot that I have on with them. Um, but these are one of like one of my favorites. I love the grain on this one, the finish. Button fly on them, run true to size. So I have that normal Judy Blue fit and stretch. Boyfriend fit, so they are relaxed. I did have these on last week in the live and a few pictures throughout the week were posted in these. Little bit of distressing in the knee areas. And then the boot that I have on is launching today. I have to take some better photos of it because I have yet to do that. Another one of those little things that I didn't get to right before. Um, but this is the Kenya. We released the Kenya last year in gray. Um, I have it myself and it is one of the most comfortable little boots. Um, 
ever. Like I absolutely love it. It's super soft on the inside, has like a little bit of a like a furry soft inside in there and then zipper for on and off kind of a combat style boot um but in the black now we didn't have black last year and i love the black so cute new boot releasing tonight runs very true to size i'm an eight and a half or nine i do the eight and a half in this one and it's just fantastic um there is a little zipper here that is working that you can undo if you want it to even like sit wide or open um where it's even more relaxed up top, you can unzip there, but it's certainly not snug on me as it is right now. But this is a cute one, especially if you have a wider calf um, or ankles, these are not too tight and they're just fantastic. So super cute, new boot. Okay, what are you looking at, Christine? I was looking at your cankle. <laughs> My cankle. Checking to see how it fit in that boot. <laughs> Thanks. Do the laces tie? They wrap around. So, like, you actually don't tie them. Tie them. And you never will. <laughs> Unless you cut them and add your own. <laughs> <laughs> but they wrap around the back of the boot. So, all you have to do is a zipper. All right. I don't think I have a clip over here. Oh, oh do you want mine? Probably. I'll take mine out. No, I got one right here. Okay. We. Is yeah. That's what you wanted me to do? Yeah, that's what I wanted you like to do. This? Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's perfect. Okay. Christina wanted me to come out here with my Grinchy hair when I put something Grinch on. <laughs> <laughs> there was a question earlier. How our hair would look during Grinch items. Well, this is absolutely superb, <laughs> I would say. <laughs> this is what I walk around like at home before I get to flat iron my hair. You should see her at like 3 o'clock in the morning when we're still here working and she starts like <laughs> flock of seagulling her hand, hair by yeah. just running her hands through it. It does some fun things when I want it to. Mm -hmm. All right. Next up, you guys, the Grinch embroidered crew neck sweatshirt. This little guy is adorable. Solid Kelly green, definitely a Grinchy color, and then has the embroidered Grinch on here. And it's just so cute. I love, like, I just love it. It's not in your face, not a huge Grinch, nothing crazy, but that little Grinch, perfect little touch of Grinchy. Um, slightly relaxed fit, again, unisex fit. So sizing up or down is optional, or not down, sizing up is optional. I've got a little fuzz in my hair. I want to mess that up. Um, but slightly relaxed fit. So sizing up is optional if you like an oversized or a little bit roomier fit. Um, sometimes I like to just go with a medium or even a large sweatshirt for a little bit more room. It's So it's up to you how you want to size these, but otherwise they are true to size. And then you've got a little embroidered fringe. He's cute. He is cute. Okay. I love him. Change. Do you love him? Love him. Nobody's complimenting my hair. I don't like it. I think the Dawn's liked it. <laughs> Just Dawn. She's the only one. Mm -hmm. I don't even she laughed at it. I don't even know. Yeah, and then Dawn Emerling hearted it, so the Dawns loved it. <laughs> the Dawns loved it. Maybe you want to try it on side with that next one. What? Those jeans. No. Okay. Is this okay to go or anything? Yes. Okay. I was just curioso lover. about the jeans. No, didn't need to do that. Okay. I think I was going to do this first with it and then pull the... Gotcha. Thing. The Grinch is like the best Christmas movie of all time. All of them. Oh gosh, here comes the debate. Like, I would watch all of them. The Christmas movies are all of the Grinches. Like, all of the Grinches. Listen... I will also watch every single Hallmark movie, but nobody can tell me any of them are actually good. Some of them are good. I mean, like, it. I love them, but the acting is, is terrible. Good. I love my hair like this. But I love them all. I will watch them all. Uh, let me pop a comment, and Don, I will get fabric content on... That Grinch sweatshirt. All right, next up is it's perfect. Thanks, <coughs> Dawn. I'm leaving it like this. 
Next up is the Just a Glimpse button down in brown. This, I just like this as a layer um, available on the website. Some of you may have snatched up during deal or no deal even, I think. Runs true to size, great flannel, basic button down, very traditional fit, not oversized, but not a slim women's cut either. Just very, very true to size. I loved it with this little Santa for a fun layer. Um, we actually had this Santa last year. Cool Santa, I think is what he's called. What's he called? Yeah. And he sold out in record time. And I think we might have got a restock, but then sold out again. And by then, we just couldn't get any more before the holiday. So, chill leopard. Chill leopard Santa. So, we brought him back this year since I could get him. Again, with plenty of time. So, cute, just simple button down. If you guys got this one last year, it's adorable. You can wear it, like, every day in December. Yeah. He's cute. Yeah. So cute little Santa, little leopard, kind of ombre leopard details in his sunglasses and his hat. It's just fantastic. So available in small through 3X, runs true to size, slightly relaxed fit here. I think that this one might be 100% cotton. Can't, can't read it. It is a Bella Canvas tee, but... Um, I can look. It's 100% cotton. Okay, you got it. Oh my gosh, that almost made me pass out. <laughs> Stretching my neck too far. Um, 100% cotton. So same as that shimmy shimmy cocoa what is size up one if you like a little bit of a roomier fit or we'll dry it. Otherwise, stay true to size and chill Santa. Okay, I gotta change. Gods to change. Gods to. Gods to gods to gods to change. We're in the home stretch. We in got the home this. stretch, you guys. We we're got this. I think we do. With all these outfits, we still, we're going to do it. Yeah, we're fine. Listen, 1045 at the latest. We're out of here. Well, we're not out of here, but we're off. Well, we're off of here. Whatever. Don't ruin things for me. Out. You did? Yeah. Okay. Me. Mad! Were you gonna change your jeans this time? No. <laughs> okay, well you're supposed. Yes, I will change to. my jeans. I just need to remind me. I don't, literally everybody heard that, right? <laughs> everybody heard it, right? That I asked if she was you gonna change like, her jeans. No, you said it more like you thought I was stupid rather than like, hey, just a reminder, you're supposed to change your jeans. I can't help what you heard. <laughs> I can't. I, there's nothing I can do about that. I don't know why you just word it like that. I know. You don't know why either? I'm just <laughs> trying to soften the blow at this point. <laughs> you can actually hear it however you want to. <laughs> She's so mean. It's so mean. Look at how when I put that clip in though, look at this volume I got. So good. Next up is the Learn to Love cardigan in ruby red. This is available in sizes small through 2X. This is already available on our website. And it's just a great cardigan for Christmas, for Valentine's Day, for Fourth of July, for any holiday or any day of the year. Just a cute one. We do have these in several different colors. Um, relaxed fit. Kind of oversized a lot of people have opted to size down one in it but lightweight like a jersey knit material 95 percent rayon five percent spandex um sizing down is definitely an option if you would like it to be a little bit more fitted less roomy little side slits there and little front pockets so just a really good one and i love this graphic tee it says jesus is the reason which is very true and a good reminder for us glitter red glitter on this one and then i love this tea. This tea though is 100% cotton um, with not much or any, to be honest, no stretch. So let me pull it down so y'all can see because it is runs a little bit more fitted and I want y'all to see that. So it's slightly relaxed up top, but see how it's more fitted like in my hips and my body. Um, this would be one that I would suggest sizing up one if you, if again, I'm a size eight shown in a small. So if you're a size four or six, you don't need to size up. So not everybody across the board, but being a size eight, I'd be more comfortable in the medium to give me more room here in my hips. I mean, I could wear it just up, you know, on my waist and be okay being in the small with a little bit of a relaxed fit and not have it 
pulled all the way down, that would be an option as well. Uh, but I think typically myself, I would go up to the medium in this for a little bit more room so that I could wear it long line if I wanted to and not feel like it was so snug. Plus it's 100% cotton. So the chance, you know, of shrinking it if somebody dries it. Um, I love the color of this tea too. It's a little bit more of like a dark sage rather than like a uh, brighter green. So I just like that too for something a little bit different. Um, and then the jeans I have on, what are these? They're the Judy Blue Buffalo Plaid. Destroy me. Boyfriend jeans. Hey, what she said. Judy Blue Buffalo Plaid Destroy me. Boyfriend jeans. So these are a fun one. Boyfriend fit. Some really stretchy material. Um, slightly relaxed. Boyfriend, slightly relaxed this whole area down. Now, for me, I feel like they're a little fitted on my hips, not in a bad way. Um, they will stretch a little bit with wear. Normal Judy Blue would fit in my waist. I stay true to size in these. Some people opt to size down in a boyfriend jean to a smaller size. I love true to size with just that natural lex fit that you get with a boyfriend jean, the intended style. Um, so I stay true to size in these. What's fun is that these have this heavy distressed area. Let me get close so you can see. But then they have this traditional buffalo plaid. I'd say it's more, and it's denim. Oh, it's denim in there. It's not like a flannel. It's denim. So it's blue and red denim that's underneath there. Um, so just a cute one. What shoe do we have that was red and blue? The mix, I think, had red, blue, and black in it. Oh. That was a cute little sneaker. I don't know if we have many left, but it had blue in it. And it was like... You, See, you can see blue, but it also could be black. It just depends, I think, on what you had appeared with. But super cute. So both knees, there's no holes that show any skin um, at all. These are both patched with that denim. That's so fun. I didn't realize that it was denim in there. So cute detail here. Judy Blue, Buffalo Plaid, Destroy Knee Boyfriend Jeans. Run true to size. If you size down in your boyfriends, you can go down in these too. Got that normal fit, but... I don't know. I like the true size with that relaxed set. Oh, and they are able to be uncuffed. So if you wanted to wear them long, you could as well. So typically, 99.9% .9 of the time, Judy Blue cuffs are not tacked. So if you see them cuffed or pictures of them cuffed, they can be uncuffed. Always in the details, we have inseams of them cuffed and uncuffed. So you guys can see um, what that is. So 28 inches with these cuffed, 31 inches uncuffed. Uh, so for tall gales and short gales, you have options. All right, you can change. Okay. I might just do this. Okay. No, it doesn't really match, but I need to read it. It's, we'll take pictures of the other page. Okay. I'm just going to delete that one out of there so I don't have to start. Play a little bit of that. Well, that. Well, that. Well, that. I don't know why you're so bad. Are you saying the word rural? You let it roll. Roll. Roll area. Roll. 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 Basically, I have to choke on the word to say it. I say it for real. Roll. 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 Rural, rural. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like you have to make the weirdest shape with your mouth. You should come out here so you can see yourself saying it on camera. Oh no, I can rural. feel myself choking with <laughs> my tongue as I try. Rural. <laughs> rural. 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 Welcome to Where did that come from? Why are we talking about that? <laughs> I don't I even have to rewatch it. I don't actually know how we made that. <laughs> All right. Kane. Okay. All right, next up. Say Earl with the er in front. Earl. <laughs> <laughs> we can change it for me, Kathy. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was great. All right, next up, you guys, is the Pep in Your Stuff Puffer Vest. This is one that we already have in stock, um, but it's a really cute layer for this time of year. I love it, too. Like, if you're doing little holiday things, running errands, going shopping, this is a great layer to have. It's fun, something a little bit different, adds a little pep to your outfit, but it's cute, too, for, like, a girl's lunch. If you're going to do your, like, Christmas lunch or Christmas get-together, you don't get super dressed up. This is a fun piece to feel good and girly, and then you can layer it over 
fun graphic tees. So I have on here a new graphic tee. Uh, pepping your stuff true to size and just have adjustable waist on it so that way you can adjust loose and tighten it give yourself more of a waist look um if you'd like but stay true to size in this one it is so stinking cute um so this other new yes Kellyanne, very good candy they are so cute um this is the jesus is the best gift long sleeve graphic tee available in extra small through 3x um so long sleeve bella canvas tee so uh, the same as the other bella tees that we've talked about um most of all tonight we had the one that was 100 percent cotton but this was a blend 50 percent cotton 25 poly 25 rayon um, and it just is a really great fit. So unisex fit, technically, I'm shown in the small. This is the size I would stay in. But just again, another really cool Callian uh, design here with the present. A little bit of animal print on there, which is fun. And then Jesus is the best gift. That's what it says. Did I read it already and read it wrong? No, you read oh, Okay. It. I feel like I said Jesus is the reason, but that was like four shirts ago. Um, so Jesus is the best gift. So stinking cute. I would say stay true to size in this one. Size up if you like oversized, but a fun one too to pair even with that plaid would be cute and other things. So I'm going to throw on one more sweatshirt, maybe. Two, one more, two more, one more, um, one more. And then we have ampersands for you. I don't know what voice I was just singing in, but it was a good one. That's a cute combo together there. Hey, thanks. I thought so. Hey, we was still like Christmas Eve church service. <laughs> <laughs> that would be great. Party at the top. This is on the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh. Three ones are fine. That'll do. That'll do, Donker. That'll do. All right, here we go. Grinchy, Grinchy sweatshirt, Grinchy hair. Um, another cute Grinch one. All right, so little Grinch hand, glitter hand, glitter ornament, and this one says Merry Chris, Merry Grinchmas on the side. <laughs> Merry Grinchmas. Um. So stinking cute. I love it. We have had this hand before with an ornament. I can't remember if it said anything. I don't think it said anything, but I it think did it not say Mary Grinchman's t-shirt. Yes, we have not had it in a sweatshirt. So love that the details are in glitter. Unisex fit on this one. And I would say it runs true to size. So I'm in the small, stay in the, your true to size, size up one, just to feel like an oversized drew mirror fit and want it to be a little bit longer. Um, but yeah, love it. Heather Gray material. Can't tell you if I ever can it because I can't read it. Don't want to break my neck or pass out here. Um, I can look up Mary Grinchmas for you. Okay, but yeah, super cute. Super cute. Don't forget to do your hair grinchy when you wear this. I want to see pictures. Uh, 50 cotton, 50 poly. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. I'll be moving just for a second. Okay. Um, you guys, too, we had today, I think, a full run of... What well, brand is that sweatshirt? Is that, is that Gildan, I think? Gildan. It's a Gildan brand. Can. Gildan Heavy Blend, if that means something to you. Gildan Heavy Blend. Um, you, know, you guys, I touch clothes all day long, and that doesn't mean anything to me. I'm, yeah. I'm impressed if you know what that means. Well, people don't order, like, sports sweatshirts and things, no. I said I'm impressed. Wow. I know. If you would open your ears more, <laughs> you would know what I said. Why are you yelling? Well, because you didn't hear it when I said it. It's almost like I was talking on my words. <laughs> I'm going to choke on that drink. I just <laughs> All right. We have a couple new bracelets, too. Little bracelet stacks. These are fantastic for this time of year. Um, and are so fun in the buffalo plaid. We do have buffalo plaid goodies on the way. And some that I think arrived today that we will launch next week but these are so fun cute little christmas um well buffalo plaid isn't just christmas but they're fun for the holiday season and 
these are fantastic little five strand bands, stretchy. These make really great gifts to pair them with a fun pair of earrings. We have buffalo plaid studs uh, in stock right now that it would make a cute gift as well. But these are so cute and restocked or brand new. I think, I don't know that we had the silver in these colors in these combos before. I know we had the gold. I can't remember. I feel like we had the silver. We have the gold too, I think. The red plaid gold. All right. This graphic tee is called the plaid tree. That was hard. Plaid tree acid wash long sleeve graphic tee available in small through 3X. Um, again, slightly relaxed fit. I would say stay true to size, size up one if you like a little bit of a roomier fit. I have room in the sleeves, um, but it's up to you. Again, sometimes I just like a roomier fit tee, a little bit longer. I can wear it with leggings. Uh, so that's up to you. But I love this traditional plaid um, on the tree. So cute option. And now Christine's up. You get the rest. What are you talking? I only have the, sh the Why? pants on. Why didn't you change? Because we're splitting them. I don't understand. You could have gotten a jump start. I don't know. Okay. I don't have a plan. You should keep that shirt on because you have a full zip somewhere in there that has nothing to match it with. You guys, we've spent a lot of hours together the last <laughs> two months. <laughs> yes, we have from working the family vacation to dealer no deal and I don't know if you guys know this, but Black Friday is a couple of weeks away. <laughs> we'll be apart for the first time in January. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, are you guys ready? I got both. I don't know why I didn't split like that. I don't I know why both either. Up there. Maybe we, <laughs> maybe we do. Probably do. Yeah. There were points during deal or no deal that were like, okay, we're here to do this together and we'd be in separate rooms. <laughs> <laughs> it was not, we did not have any issues, but we just chuckled when we were apart. It wasn't intentional at all, at least for my part. I don't know what maybe she was trying to get away from I was me. In the same room for maybe she hours. was trying to get away from me. I didn't go anywhere. <laughs> all right, you guys, first up here, um, these plaids do not match. So don't be confused by that. We just put this on because I did not pull a long sleeve tee for me to put on with this ampersand. Uh, so I didn't want to confuse you there. But this ampersand and these joggers match. So new ampersand holiday collection launching today. Excited about this and all these fun pieces. So full zip. This one is called Merry and Bright. Has a fun plaid inside of here. Blues, greens, reds. Little bit of a all like a light tan camel color and then matching joggers now these joggers run very true to size compared to what we had last year as well um same fit details and all of that so i am in the medium i do believe did you ever look kind of i didn't look at yours but i know I'm in the that medium. i am in the 2x like normal okay i am in the medium um so nice fit in these working drawstring and i these have great stretch to them so that is really nice if you like an oversized fit jogger then we recommend sizing up one these fit where I do have some like relaxed room here. Um, but more in the leg, I feel like they fit more like a legging. Not uncomfortable, not too snug, nothing odd about it, but they aren't like a relaxed jogger, which I think often we think of, at least I do when I think of joggers, but side pockets on these, fun print. And then the back of this hoodie says Miri and Bright printed on it. This little combo, um, I'm in the small sweatshirt and I would say runs true to size. So a light heather oatmeal um, with the fun accents. I love this combo. It's fun for Christmas morning or just leading up to Christmas season uh, because it's plaid. Well, I guess it says Merry and Bright on the back that it does make it a little bit more holiday-ish, um, but it's a cute one. So you could just pair it with a solid color tee to bring out one of the other colors in it, but true to size, normal. It's even skin. really cute with that little plaid tree, too. It is. I know the they're identical, but they have the same colors. Yeah, that's true. If somebody 
doesn't like things that don't match, then they won't be happy that the right. pants don't match. But normal Judy Blue fit, 95% cotton, 5% spandex, so stretchy, lighter weight. I'm showing in the small, stay true to size, size up if you like an oversized fit or if you know your ampersand full size or full zip size, then stick with that one in this in this print. But yeah, super cute. Love full zips. All right. We are splitting these up to get through them just a wee yes. bit faster. I am going to take your mm, happy Santa. But all of these are the same material too. Fabulous. All right. So I am in the first of the double hoods. Let me start with the bottoms. I am in the same joggers that Rachel had on, the triple stretch, fabulous joggers. Look at all that room in them. I am in the 2X. That's traditionally what I've always done. Oh, that would be really cute too. Rachel just pulled out this Jesus is the reason. That would be cute with that, that is, full zip. Yes, it would be great. If you didn't want to worry about mixing your plaids, this Jesus is the reason perfect is the perfect color. color match. So I'm in the 2X in the triple stretch joggers. That is what I typically stick with with the joggers. Did you say gray or oatmeal? It is definitely where are we at. They call Which that one? oatmeal on the site. It looks like Both a of these they call oatmeal. There, I mean, even oh, the sleeve to mine is considered oatmeal, but I mean, I suppose if somebody asked me, I would call it a really light gray. I don't think that oatmeal. You know why I think, like, I think it's more of a creamy color mixed with gray. So I think like it's a cream with gray heathering to it where it's not white and gray and it's not gray and gray. It's like cream with gray. So they call it oatmeal. Ampersand refers to this as oatmeal, but it does have gray in it. Mm -hmm. So I'm in the first of our double hoods with welt pockets. <laughs> all I hear when Rachel Wilt. says welt pockets. Well, it has pockets. Welt pockets, triple stretch. So I am in an extra large, plenty of room. Stay true to size in this. I would not size down. If you want a roomier fit, you can size up. But this is my normal fit in ampersands, and I like the extra large. This one is called Happy Santas. And the reason, look at these cute little letters that say Mary with all of the different Santas and presents and little trees. So that's all the way across in the Mary. So that is your Happy Santa Ampersand Double Hood and also matches these joggers. Not the same print, but some of the same colors that if you, I'm not a matchy match person, so I would totally wear this on Christmas morning to open up Christmas presents. Okay. Happy Santa. I don't know where Tree Farm over oh, here I went, but she's something. coming. <laughs> I thought I heard rustling out there. Oh, okay. Another bird? Maybe another, another bird. bird. All right. This one is a fantastic as well. How stinking cute is this? What is this one called? Don't know. Uh, I didn't look at you. Can you look at I'm in the trees? Oh yeah, I made fun of you. Yeah. Fun. It's called Happy Holidays. Happy holidays. That's easy. Oh, Happy holidays. holidays. Um no, I mean on the zip one. If, Sue, if you're asking about the color, it was the same. I brought that over. Um, so that gray oatmeal, the details are the same. All of these that are, you're going to see three that are in that same color way. They're all calling them oatmeal. The full zip, the one Christine was just in, and then there's another one. So they're calling it oatmeal, but it's that creamy I'll with the gray. I'll hold up against this one. Okay. Um, okay. So I'm in the, the Happy Holidays, which this is adorable. Again, triple triple stretch with wilt pockets um, on the side. So that's not a kangaroo pocket. Your hands don't touch. They're just two pockets on the side. Little or your side zip detail here, which is a working zipper, but opens up to nothing. Um, and then I love the contrasting material here being that green stripe. It's so fun with this large scale tree print. And this is so cute with this mix of trees, just some fun colors, a little bit of different colors. We're again in those sage natural tones, uh, muted tones, but absolutely adorable. Like, look how cute. Look at them all. These are adorable. Happy holidays. So triple stretch. Color-wise, it still matches these joggers great. So if you like doing the plaid and want to do that, just remember that you have stripe accents. I don't think it really matters because I don't know that you're going to be wearing this like out in public. 
like to where anybody would pick up on like stripes and plaid and all of that. But you would, Christine, you, well, you wouldn't be wearing this out in public together like this. Oh my gosh, she's throwing me. <laughs> so anyways, cute combo for at home. But yes, just take note that there are stripes <laughs> and plaid if you were to pair these together. Color-wise, all the same family. They kept this cute little collection all semi-matching. So two to size, size up just if you like an oversized fit. I'm shown in this small. Okay, so you're asking about your stuff. Uh, the this same. That's why I brought that one over. Yes. Okay, so... Asking about the zip, it is the same color as the sleeve on that double hood that I was in. That's why we brought them together. This is what they what Ampersand considers oatmeal. This is the gray. So same color on the double hood sleeve as there is on the full zip. Oatmeal, gray. So those are the color differences. I am in the other, the third, the third, the third, not the other, the third double hood that we have. This one is Heather Gray with a hunter green hood, hunter green thumb holes, and just has this really cute Be Merry embroidery on the front of it. Again, well, pockets, <laughs> and I am in my I true love size that again. What else did you notice? What else have you noticed about it? Like anything else? Have you noticed anything else fun about it? Oh my God, it's like, got candy cane hearts. Look at the candy cane hearts. I didn't notice. I was trying to feel all over. Will all tabs be on the website tonight? Yes, yes they will. What is on the arm? Stacy, thanks for your help. Candy cane hearts right on the sleeve. Look at how cute that is. All embroidered. There's I thought, no message on the inside. I oh yeah, there is. It. It says festive feels only. She's so close to me that could have hit her and killed her. <laughs> killed her. <laughs> so stay true to size. Again, unless you like a roomier fit, size up one, but I am in my that embroidery is so cool. Extra large. I love the embroidery. Me too. All right, I'll get you a comment. Cowl neck, and then we do these last. Yes, okay. ma'am. Okay. Mm-hmm. You got it. You got her, Otter. Got her, Otter. All right. Hmm, just freckles. It look different. That freckle looked different. Does it look like skin It looks like you punched me in the face. <laughs> no. I just okay. look like a, I don't know what I did. All right. Next up is the single hood sweatshirt. Candy cane wish is available in extra small through three X. Now this is traditional ampersand Avenue, single hood, same material, same cut, same, all the jazz of a single hood. Hold on. I got to stretch it out just a little bit. <laughs> um, so single hoods. Well, what do we know about single hoods? They don't have quite as much stretch, right? Um, the material is fleece lined. So they are warmer than double hoods and all the other items that you're seeing tonight because they are fleece lined, but that also makes them thicker and a little less stretchy. So while the other materials are triple stretch, that means they stretch in three directions. This one stretches really nice here, stretches here. Do I mean, kind of doesn't quite stretch as much because it is that fleece lined, so it is thicker. Welt pockets on this one. I am shown in my small, but it's a little bit of a slimmer, snugger fit because of that fleece adding some thickness to it. Um, and and it's only a single hood. So it has this real big hood that has more of that like cowl funnel neck on it. Um, more like a turtleneck style. Love it. Some people don't. If you don't do turtlenecks, things around your neck, then I would advise to stay away from this style because it's one that like, if you don't like that style, you're just, you're not going to like it on this either. Even though it's not real snug, like I have room in there. It's just, if you're claustrophobic -y about some types of clothing, then this would be one I'd stay away from. I am not. I absolutely love the single hoods. I think they're fantastic. Fit wise, again, I'm still showing in the small, um, in this one, but most do opt to size up one for a little bit more room since you don't have quite the stretch that we do in the others. But cute pink blush, blush pink background with the candy canes. So this is a really cute one. I absolutely love this available in extra small through 3X. Hey, here comes Christine. Hey, Christine. Hey, Christine. I'll let you wear, wear the other, the funny one. Oh, or whatever. 
I don't care. I don't care. Okay. So this one is an actual cowl neck. Like Rachel said with that single hood, kind of get that funnel neck. This is an ampersand cowl neck. So no hood, just this really great cowl, not tight against your throat at all. So no worries of feeling like you're going to constantly be stretching out claustrophobia. Even if you don't like things tight against your neck, this one is not going to sit up against your neck. This has a kangaroo pocket. So your hands meet in the middle and it says Mary in this candy cane stripe across still has the traditional thumb holes. And because this is a triple stretch. Once again, I am in my true size extra large. This is the size that I stay in in all of my ampersands. Other than the single hood, there was a question about if I stay true to size in my single hoods. I like going up to the 2X. I'll even do a 3X if that's what we happen to have in stock. Doesn't hurt me at all to go all the way up a couple sizes because like Rachel said, it's fleece lined. So it doesn't have that triple stretch that stretches in every single direction. So fabulous I little color neck. Did you show them that Mary. it was like like sewn on? It's like it's like sewn on. I mean it is. It's like it's applique sewn on. So these it's are actual sonar. little details. Sometimes well you don't know because some of them are printed and some I of know. our I know. Sorry. Did you already talk about that or no? No, I told them that it was Mary and Candy Cane. But I did not tell them what that about it was the cute sewn little fun on. fun stitch. The fun stitch. It's like a very holiday stocking and elf did it. Oh, 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 oh balls. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys. This is like the softest thing. I, 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 it's just so soft and cozy. Man, they must really brush this material to get it like super. Is it, is it like feeling? Yeah, <laughs> it's like suede, like brush. It's like hide, just brushed and brushed and brushed until it's so soft. <laughs> It is so stinking soft. Okay, so university pullover. This one is called Holiday Kisses. Um, normal university pullover fit that we've talked about. Relaxed material, oversized, a little bit roomier than the straight cut we're used to with ampersand, um, but normal university fit. 95% cotton, 5% spandex, creamy color, super comfy. I'm showing in the small. Um, it's like these are meant to be oversized university pullover style. Sizing down is optional, uh, but I'm in my true boutique size small and I love the fit of it. This one has this fantastic holly mistletoe. Is this a mistletoe? Like Hello, technically. Kiss me. So mistletoe um, on here and I guess you would call this embroidered. It's like super soft. It feels so delicate and sweet. I love it. Um, but it is actually, you know, embroidered 3D little holly things there. It's cute. So a little embroidered on there. And then this one also says ho, ho, ho embroidered on the sleeve. Oh, that's cute. Isn't that cute for that fun little up the sleeve detail? Love I keep it. checking my sleeves. Keep checking your sleeves. Yeah. All right. Christina's the last, but not the least. How oh, balls. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in an Ampersand University pullover. How oh, balls. <laughs> it's the same as Rachel's did. I'm in my extra large. Balls. It's very oh, yeah. soft. Yeah. It's like, oh, it's not. Oh, it, that's very soft. That's very soft. I don't have anything on my sleeve, but I have balls on my shirt. I have an <laughs> ornament with a snowflake. Oh, balls. Oh, balls. <laughs> so, yeah, true to size in these university pullovers for that relaxed Super fit. comfy. So cute. All this right. I would wear out in public. <laughs> <laughs> you would. I would. Oh, it's just cozy, though. It's so cozy. So cozy. I don't have a lot of details to talk about with the Ampers and university so pullovers since it's the same fit. This is screen printed on though, not embroidered. Yes. All right. That's it, folks. That's it, folks. That's all, folks. That's all. That's all. All right. 
You guys, we're going to go ahead and get this inventory loaded to our website. You can find all these goodies in the featured collection new this week on the app and on the site. Um, I will also work on cleaning up that holiday collection and getting things put in pretty places and organized well. Uh, we'll let you know as earrings and all that stuff get added and arrive. Um, I hate to wait a week for those, but we'll see. Depends when they arrive. Um, but so many cute new holiday pieces tonight and there are more to come. So thank you for la launching the holiday season with us. Maybe you already have launched it. You have your tree up. You've already done all your Christmas shopping. Let's hope not. Um, because we've got lots of goodies to share with you. So anyways, we'll get these loaded. Happy holidays and happy shopping. Feliz Navidad.